Good morning, everybody. My name is Iman Ethos, and welcome back to Boss Frame. Um, we are, of course, here looking at our Excalibur, our Buzzlock, our Glass Eye, Jaw Sword, as usual, and Exalted Blade. Now, I'll run through again the upgrades so you guys can see the builds. There'll be a fairly fla uh, fast little flash, so if you want to rec uh, record these builds, make sure to hit a pause and do them yourself. Because we have a whole other set of things we're going to be looking at today. And the reason for that is because we are going to be doing Jordis Golem. Now, Jordis Golem is... So, vehicles. Jordis Golem is a half in a ship combat, and then also a half in Arcwing combat. And the Arcwing combat is a little bit simple, but it's still annoying. So we're going to be running the It's All with two things. Energy Amplifier and System Reroute. Pretty simple, pretty basic stuff. The Fluctus, which I understand is a, not a very common weapon, and I do have some rare mods in there. But so one thing you'll find out really quickly is if you do Arcwing, you'll get these rare mods fairly easily, because there's so few mods, just in general, for Arcwing, that they're fairly common. And then also using the Kassas. I can do Bleeding Edge, woo! We up to a 25% secret chance. Anyways, so there's that, there's that. So let's go ahead and get started from this. Make sure you're changing to solo. Now, I'm not sure how easy or how hard this is going to be, because I have long, it's been a long time since I've done the Jordan of Skolum as a mission. But it is an infested mission of fairly high level as well. Okay, so we need to get stirring. It knows you are here. I can feel it wake. Find it. The Furliat pods. Is that it? I really thought you would have more. Have you been using them? That is not enough for him. You are just like all the others. You won't kill the golem. I don't want you to. That was interesting. As you can see, not exactly the easiest enemies to fight. We're just trying to get away and out of here, so it shouldn't be too impossible. 600 meters until our target. And a friendship door. There we go. My friendship door. And something to remember is that there will, you will not always have the same layout in any particular uh, mission. Just... And as a general rule of thumb, what the? Wait, what? I came, I came in through that door. Um, what? Okay, somewhere around here there's a door. Somewhere around here there's a door. I know there is. Ah! I'm gonna bring out my glass side for this. Yeah. Oh right, he's regenerate. Um, where is? I'm so confused by this. Like. There should be like a door or an entrance somewhere around here. Yes, I am very mistaken, and this is a complete. Oh no, oh, here it is. Here we are. There's a staircase. Ah, uh, knew there'd be a doorway around here somewhere that would lead up. Okay. I see what you're doing. 
No, no, it's not about forgetting. It's about um, not knowing. Every every mission is slightly random, randomly generated. So it's hard to so it's hard to say exactly where some rooms will lay out and connect up to each other. Ah, and here we are with the golem. So this is where fun's about to start. Oh, hello, Mr. Golem. Hello, Mr. Juggernaut. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, jeez. Slicey dicey, slicey dicey mo. Oh, ow. You have no idea what I am. Join us, and you will. There it is. I am a cephalon. I serve my. You are our voice. Yep. And now we get jumped into Arcwing mode, and we have to fight the Jordas Golem. Just the beginning. And now we get to see this big boy. So. The Jordan Skull himself is actually immune to all damage, but his engines are a different story. Basically, he'll just kind of move between a couple different points and attack, and all you have to do is get behind him and hit him in the engines. See, it's like so. And avoid the flaming booms of doom. Oof! Oh, what was that? Gotta get behind Mr. Golem. Oh, wait, what? Is that the wall? Apparently so. That's a frustration. One of the only problems with this particular weapon is it's fairly slow. Yeah, and there's a death. Is this, this is just basically what the Jordan's goal is. Just smack into those engines as much as you can. kind of lay out a, def a destructive wave of doom. Oh, that was poison. That was poison. Um. Boris, you came to save me. Free me. Let's see where he's going now. Come on! Gonna unleash some waves.
garage left than I saw one. <laughs> the golden what? What? Oh, come on. Uh... Well, I think our Jordan's Golem might have gotten a slight bit of, uh... Pathing issues. Yeah, I think I'm good. Thank you. Unleash hell! Oh boy. This is gold. See, the gold just takes a long time to kill unless you have multiple people shooting it with multiple weapons at the same time. Or a good, a good heavy damage rapid fire weapon, which, unfortunately, not really possible. Ow, fire, burn, death, ow. I'm gonna die. Nope, I'm still good. Somehow. The golem is kind of upside down, though. Which, I mean, I guess, in a three dimensional environment, kind of hard to be upside down, so. Can I, can I hit from this far? Or was the fall off too extreme at that one point? Nope. Oof, oof. Mmm. <laughs> Ow. Well, it seems like every so often this does not hit exactly where it's supposed to be. Ow! Useless hollow shells. Oh, what? What? I was stealthed! Can I just, can I unload hell on him? Nope, nope. He always finds a way to get free. That's unfortunate. So I think we'll be able to kill him fairly easily with minimal issues. Healing. Yeah, I'm probably gonna die, but that's okay. I should have learned by now that that does not stop him fireball from hurting my face. Oh, this is bull. Like, what the- 
Okay. Get rid of that guy. Ooh, is he close enough? Can I actually do damage? No. Nah. He is almost dead. The Jordan's Golem himself is not that challenging until you do him as a raid. Which, granted, that was a long time ago. When Jordan's Golem was a raid... Hmm. And that's a dead boy. Don't kill me. No, wait. Please do. Thank you, operator. And extraction is where? Oh, okay, there we go. Never mind. Look, wait, hold up. What? Assassination contract complete. So we got the Atlas systems. So that's it for you. I mean, it's really a simple fight. Just bring something with a good amount of dam a decent amount of damage, high fire rate, a good clip size. Bring some friends, and the Jordan Golem's not that hard of an enemy to fight. Now, starting tomorrow, or as as of tomorrow, which will be our first video of the year, we're doing this little special thing for New Year's. And then we'll also be doing a video on our last boss, I believe we have left to do, which will be Mutalist Alad V. I believe that's the only boss I have left to fight in the entire star chart. Yes, that is. Yes, that is. All right. So, everybody, I think thank you, everybody, for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. If, for, you know, if you want to see more videos, obviously. And um, if you want to leave a comment, leave a comment in the comment section. Good or bad, I will get back to it as soon as I can. Until then, everybody, have a rest, re great rest of your day. Wonderful New Year's Day, New Year's Eve. And I'll see you guys all in 2016. Bye, everybody.